Good afternoon. I'm Conway Mayor Bart Castleberry. I'm here this afternoon with Brad Lacey, the president of the Conway Area Chamber of Commerce. Good afternoon, Brad. Good afternoon. As you can see, we're practicing our social distancing. Uh, we would just like to bring you up to speed a little bit on some of the things that are going on in Conway. One is that the Con city of Conway is open for business. So if you're a citizen uh, and you have need of any of our services in the city, all you have to do is call the department that you need to talk to and someone from that department will answer your call. They will answer your question and uh, if you have an issue that they can take care of, they most certainly will. So it's a little bit different. We're operating remotely, but we are still taking care of business. It's a new normal for a while and uh, hopefully uh, we'll not see too many glitches in it. That being said, I want to just briefly share with you some of the things that have changed, uh, some things we've had a few calls on. One is our recycling. During this time, we are going to stop our recycling. Now, we will not stop our normal trash route pickups. We will continue to do that, but our recycling is going to stop for a while for a couple of reasons. One is that uh, the area that where our recyclables are, are sorted is very confined and our personnel cannot practice their uh, social distancing safely and in the best interest of their health as well as the health of the community, we're going to forego that. If you want to recycle, you can still take your recyclables out to Highway 64 West and the Sanitation Department, and they have individual bins set up so that you can drop your recyclables off there. So uh, that is one small change, but when this, like I said, when this passes, we will go back to our normal route. If you're a developer uh, or plumber, electrician, you can still call Missy or uh, Michelle at the uh, permitting office, just like you always have. Uh, and they will take your call. They will issue your permits. Likewise, when you're ready for an inspection, your uh, contractor, whether it be plumbing, HVAC, HVAC, HVAC or electrical, uh, will in turn call the inspector and you'll FaceTime with them and show them the work that you've done. They'll be able to sign off on that. And uh, so hopefully, uh, and you'll still be able to get your certificates of occupancy. So as a developer, you're not gonna see any change there, nor with our planning department. Everyone's still manning the phones and taking care of business just like they always do, we're just doing it remotely. Um, as a city, as you know, uh, in Faulkner County, now I, it's, it's 1.30 and I just at, looked at the Arkansas Department of Health website. It showed six confirmed cases of the COVID-19 in Faulkner County. I don't know if that's changed any since 1.30, but that was the last time I checked. COVID-19 is very serious and as a city, we need to take it seriously. So please practice your uh, social distancing and your and your hygiene, you're washing your hands and, and meeting in, in the groups of 10 and smaller as the governors ask us to do. Uh, really, there's the governor, and rightfully so, is in control of all commerce. So if any directives are sent down as far as businesses, and they have been already, you know, the governor has proclaimed that uh, our churches don't need to meet, uh, nor does any of our restaurants need to be open for, for regular sit down business. But he, has, he is allowing, uh, drop off, pick up. And that's what my wife and I are doing. We are still eating with our restaurants here in Conway that offer a uh, curbside pickup. And um, I really have to watch myself because I enjoy eating. And this is a, it's made kind of extra, it's made a little bit hard, made it too easy to eat. So anyway, but if you can uh, be sure and help our business, uh, small business in that area. That being said, there is one thing that we as a city can do and I would like to read this to you. It is concerning our, specifically our restaurants. In an effort to assist our local eating establishments uh, by moving inventory to prevent further waste or loss as a result of the state of Arkansas moratorium on on-premises dining and to provide additional support for the health and welfare of Conway citizens by providing alternative opportunities to purchase food and other items, the city of Conway, via uh, an order of the mayor's office, is suspending certain zoning and order ordinance restrictions on eating establishments inside the city limits under the following conditions. Uh, yes, I scratched my nose right then. Don't ever do that. Allow eating establishments to sell food, ingredients, cleaning supplies, paper goods, or other inventory. No more than 10 persons inside the premises at any time, including staff and employees. All business owners are responsible for ensuring proper social distancing practices are followed. Uh, all businesses are subject to any and all Center for Disease Control, World Health Organization, Arkansas Department of Health, federal government, and or state government orders or directives. And this order is subject to all of those, uh, the CDC, the WHO, Arkansas Department of Health, and federal government. We fall under all of their guidelines. And if at any time this executive order or any part of it is in conflict with any of the CDC, Health Department, 
federal or state order directive, then the order or directive will control uh, and again, we'll fall back under the, those orders that are listed by those groups. And this executive order is in effect for a period of 30 days. So what this basically does, uh, it allows some of our restaurants that have paper goods and cleaning supplies, not to mention produce and meats and things like that, it allows them to function much like a grocery store and, and sell those items. So uh, that's one thing that we as a city could do and that is what we're doing. At this time, I'm going to turn it over to Brad Lacey, uh, president of the Ch Conway Area Chamber of Commerce, and please, all of you be safe. Thank you. So I'm Brad Lacey. I'm president and CEO of the Conway Area Chamber of Commerce. Um, obviously, uh, this is new territory for all of us, um, and this has taken an impact on many of our businesses in the community. Um, folks like our hotel owners, uh, dentists, uh, optometrists, uh, they're all having a really hard time right now. Um, in many of our small businesses. Uh, I have seen so many of you uh, sort of try to adapt and embrace um, things like uh, Facebook and Instagram and uh, many of our citizens are responding and um, ordering things and uh, doing some curbside pickup at, at some of our, uh, our small retail businesses and that's encouraging. Uh, we really need to come together and ensure that uh, these folks weather this period of time, however long it is. Um, you know, on the bigger scale, many of our large employers are still uh, in production right now. Some of them are uh, essential to um, what we need in America right now. So an example would be West Rock. Um, they make folding cartons for the food industry. So if we want food in the freezers of our grocery stores, they have to be in a container. Um, and we are making many of those right here in Conway. So we're seeing a lot of, uh, a lot of work continuing to go on, which is good. It's good for our local economy. Uh, Bart mentioned our restaurants, and uh, on Saturday, uh, we started a Facebook group called Conway to Go, um, and I'm happy to say that uh, really uh, within 48 hours, we have almost 2,600 members of that group, and uh, I encourage any of you to, to join and uh, help remind one another of the uh, great deals that are going on right now with curbside and to-go orders. Um, and this is another part of our economy that uh, we can help um, continue to sustain itself through uh, this time period. Um, really appreciate what the mayor and the council have done um, with the restaurants, uh, as you just heard today, uh, that will allow uh, some other sources of revenue. Um, and then for those of us who are consumers, uh, here's another opportunity to buy food to prepare at home uh, and maybe some other things too uh, from those uh, places of business. So uh, keep this up, Conway. Let's keep our uh, local businesses in business as we weather this storm together.